Hi friends, I am Dr. Imran Ali, dermatologist and hair transplant surgeon. Have you ever felt self-conscious about those pesky flakes on your shoulders? You are not alone. Millions struggle with dandruff and today we are going to demystify this common scalp condition. We will explore what causes dandruff, what you can do to manage it and when it is time to see a dermatologist. Get ready to learn some science-backed strategies to get a healthier flake-free scalp. What is dandruff? That annoying flaking of the scalp is not just dry skin, it is a common skin condition technically called seborrheic dermatitis of the scalp, involving inflammation and increased skin, skin cell turnover. This leads to a noticeable shedding of the skin flakes often accompanied by itching. While dandruff is not contagious or dangerous, it can persist and it can, it can cause an embarrassing feeling and impact the self-confidence. Understanding its causes is the first step towards effective management. The role of tiny small yeasts. The science behind dandruff. At the root of dandruff lies a naturally occurring yeast called Malassezia globosa. This yeast is a normal part of scalp's microbiome, living harmoniously with most people. However, in some individuals, it multiplies excessively and disrupts the scalp's natural balance. Here is what happens. First, Malassezia globosa feeds on the natural oils, that is the sebum produced by the sebaceous glands on your scalp. Next is it produces enzymes called lipases that break down sebum into fatty acids, specifically called as oleic acid. In individuals who are sensitive to oleic acid, this triggers ir irritation and uh, inflammatory response, that is third. The inflammation uh, accelerates the production of skin cells as the cells move to the surface of the scalp and shed more rapidly, they clump together and form visible flakes. Thus, dandruff is not merely about dry skin, but a combination of microbial activity, inflammation and abnormal skin cell turnover. Why does it happen to some and not others? The susceptibility to dandruff is influenced by a variety of factors. Although Malassezia globosa exists on everyone's scalp, not everyone experiences dandruff. Scientists believe it is due to a combination of the following factors, that is genetics. Some individuals are genetically predisposed to have a stronger immune response to this oleic acid, making their scalp more prone to inflammation. Next is sebum production. Excessive oiliness often triggered by hormonal changes such as during puberty or pregnancy provides a thriving environment for yeast overgrowth. Next is stress. Stress weakens the immune system reducing the body's ability to regulate inflammation and microbial growth on the scalp. The next is climate. Dandruff often worsens in cold, dry conditions or during changes in humidity, which can disrupt the scalp's natural barrier. Next is diet. Nutritional deficiencies, particularly zinc, B vitamins and omega-3 fatty acids can impact scalp health. Some medications uh, may alter oil production or weaken the immune system contributing to dandruff. How dandruff shows up, that is the signs and symptoms. Dandruff typically manifests as white or yellow flakes. These flakes can vary in size from small and subtle to large visible scales, often seen on the scalp, hair and on the shoulders. There can be itching. The scalp may feel itchy due to irritation and can cause inflammation. Sometimes there can be redness. In some cases, visible redness accompanies the flakes, indicating underlying inflammation. Greasy or dry scalp. Depending on sebum production, the scalp may appear oily in seborrheic dermatitis or excessively dry. While mild dandruff may only cause flaking, severe cases can lead to significant discomfort and embarrassment. The treatment strategies, that is how to tackle dandruff. Effectively managing dandruff involves targeting the yeast, reducing the inflammation and maintaining healthy scalp environment. Here are some proven treatment strategies. Over-the-counter antifungal shampoos, they inhibit Malassezia globosa growth and reduce the production of the irritating fatty acids, that is the oleic acid. Use these shampoos two to three times a week for optimal results, leaving the product on the scalp for at least 
फाइव मिनट्स बिफोर रिंसिंग मेडिकेटेड शैम्पूस एंड ट्रीटमेंट्स सर्टन इन्ग्रीडियंट्स हेल्प एक्सफोलिएट एंड रिमूव द फ्लेक्स बाई लूजनिंग द क्लम्प अप स्किन सेल्स फ्यू इन्ग्रीडियंट्स स्लो डाउन द एक्सेसिव ऑयल प्रोडक्शन ऑन द स्कैल्प एंड ऑल्सो दैट लीड टू फ्लेकिंग सम फॉर्मुलेशन कंबाइन एंटीफंगल्स विथ सूदिंग एजेंट्स लाइक एलोवेरा और मैंथॉल टू काम द इरीटेशन ऑफ द स्कैल्प प्रॉपर हेयर एंड स्कैल्प केयर अवॉइड यूजिंग हार्श शैम्पूस जेल्स और स्प्रेस दैट इरीटेट द स्कैल्प फर्दर वॉश योर हेयर रेगुलरली टू प्रिवेंट ऑयल एंड बिल्डअप ऑफ दिस प्रोडक्ट्स यूज ल्यूक वॉम वॉटर एज हॉट वॉटर कैन स्ट्रिप द नेचुरल ऑयल्स प्रोड्यूस्ड बाई दिस स्कैल्प एंड इट कैन वर्सन द इरीटेशन लाइफ स्टाइल एंड डाइटरी चेंजेस मैनेज स्ट्रेस थ्रू एक्टिविटीज लाइक योगा एक्सरसाइज और मेडिटेशन टू सपोर्ट योर इम्यून सिस्टम मेंटेन ए बैलेंस्ड डाइट विच इज रिच इन जिंक ओमेगा थ्री फैटी एसिड्स बी वाइटामिन टू नरिश द स्कैल स्टे हाइड्रेटेड बाई ड्रिंकिंग टू टू थ्री लीटर्स ऑफ वाटर एंड कीप द स्किन बैरियर इंटैक्ट एंड हेल्दी नाउ वेन यू शुड सी ए डर्माटोलॉजिस्ट वेन द साइंस एंड सीवियर वेन द साइंस ऑफ दिस डैंड्रफ बिकम मोर सीवियर वाइल्ड माइल्ड डैंड्रफ कैन ऑफन बी मैनेज विथ ओवर द काउंटर सोल्यूशंस देर आर टाइम्स वेन ए प्रोफेशनल हेल्प इज मस्ट यू शुड सी ए डर्माटोलॉजिस्ट डैंड्रफ इज सीवियर और इफ इट परसिस डिस्पाइट यूजिंग मेडिकेटेड शैम्पूज you experience intense itching pain or significant redness the scalp develops crusts or lesions or signs of infection you suspect the condition can be more severe like it can be sometimes psoriasis eczema or even fungal infection dermatologists can help you provide a treatment which is tailored to you uh, with by giving antifungal shampoos solutions or even tablets so the take away points are dandruff is more than just a cosmetic issue it is a scalp condition which is influenced by yeast immune response and various external factors by understanding the science behind it and using targeted strategies you can control and achieve a healthier flake free scalp remember consistency is the key and if the problem persists professional guidance can make all the difference take care of your scalp and you will notice not just healthier hair but improved confidence as well thank you signing off